Start my hiking at dark up uh, possibly to Mount Leconte in Tennessee, Smoky Mountains. It's uh, dark out right now, headlamp. I can see the sun's kind of coming up, so won't be dark too long and uh, I'll actually see something here soon. Uh, a little bit of light's coming out. Trail's not been too bad. There are some massive trees around here. I'm gonna take a little break here for a second, grab a drink, and uh, take off my headlamp because it's getting light enough out. Oh wow, this is our truck here. I'm right about. Does look really cool. This is a national park, Great Smoky Mountain, so seeing some of these trails are really taken care of and really planned out. We were down there just a minute ago. Well, this one just came up pretty quick. Long trail. Well, a little less than a mile and a half, about 35 minutes in. And I still got a few miles to go, but this already seems like a really cool trail. So, so far, if it keeps up like this, is definitely one I would come back to. Kind of hitting up some of the highlights here. Let me put some work into this trail. Which is greatly appreciated. I'm going to wind over that way and I believe over there. Oh, cave bluffs. I'll find out in a minute. I've never been here before, so I'm gonna do an elevation check here shortly. This section has a cable along it. I guess that's uh in case it's raining or something making slippery so I don't slip off the edge here because you're gonna get hurt really bad or not make it if you fall down there. We're almost straight down off the edge here. Yeah, it's a well-engineered trail, but still getting some uh, elevation in here. Ooh. 
and the bluffs. Hour and seven minutes into the hike here, uh, just over two miles. Oh, this is awesome. Really scenic here. Definitely worth getting up at five o'clock this morning. Too bad everybody else is missing it. Get a chance to uh, check this out. Suppose a lot of people just come to this spot and call it a hike, which is just fine. Seems like an awesome destination in itself. Let me get a little sign here. Yeah, bluffs are uh, about 5,000 feet elevation. So I'm getting up there. Got about 15, 1,600 more feet to go up. Bring all my uh, GoPro stuff with me, so I'm just holding it in my hand here, making a simple video this time. Try not to extend my time too much. Awfully hard though because it's a really awesome trail. Loving it. It's getting steeper. That and uh being higher in elevation, even though it's not super high, like say the Rocky Mountains, it's still high enough where I think it makes a difference in a breathing. out in this morning smoky mountains <sighs> onward and upward probably getting close to the six thousand mark. I'll check that in a little bit. Looks like a good view here. More section with a cable, and you can definitely understand this one. It's off the side of this the drop that you're not going to live through. Awesome views, though. Great hike. 
one mile left. About 500 more feet elevation to go up. Be at the summit. Not doing too bad. Trail's really great. Join the morning. Pretty close now. Where we're at now, <clears throat> we're on these cliffs, the lookout on top of these cliffs, I believe. It's going off looking at the map. I've never been here before. A nice little flat section trail here after passing this cliff there. There's a nice little break. And we're almost at the summit here. Passed a couple people about a third of a mile away. So getting pretty close, having a great morning. Definitely glad. Um so I had to get up early and do this. This is awesome. Well, Cotton Lodge right down here. Stopping there on our way back from the summit. No road up here, so everything gets carried up by llamas or helicopter drop. Shelter, Myrtle Point, which is supposed to have good views. One over to our left. Keep going, the summit should be right up here. All right, closer to the summit, we'll take the this side trail to cliff tops on the way back. Skirts around and comes out right by the lodge there. All right, hustled on up here the rest of the way. Summit, Mount Lacant right here. Some will be in the ground, but a pile of rocks on top. So, especially touching the top. I'm not going to stack any more rocks. There's enough rocks there. But yep, this is the summit. A great hike. Take one last uh, little bit of video here at the lodge. Check that out for a minute and then head back down. No views at the summit up there, but really awesome views right next to the summit and all along this trail. Uh -huh, going over to cliff tops now. Got a little uh, reminder of home here. The one muddy spot on this whole hike.
Oh, travel beyond the sign prohibited. Alright, next up, the lodge. A quick snack, something drinking, then head on down. Ooh. Beautiful. Lodge. So if you want to stay here in the summer, you got to try and book a spot. There's a lottery system, and uh, you got to do that in the fall before the year prior. Restrooms, gift shop. Pretty neat. I just missed the Lecomte Lodge hour, so didn't get my t-shirt. I picked one up online. And head down now and catch up this uh, video back at the trailhead. be worth mentioned uh, just after leaving the lodge come back down there's a trail split here I'll make sure you go to the left It's awfully hard to not keep taking pictures and videos. Heading down. A lot of people headed down. A lot of people headed up. Very popular trail. For good reason. Getting close to the uh, trailhead. Hasn't been a bad trail, pretty mellow down here. Nice uh, stream flowing through here. Well, yep, yeah, a few more minutes. I don't know if I can say it enough, but it's been a great hike. Highly recommended, uh, but come here early though, because uh, it does get kind of crowded. 
not crazy, but it's very popular. All right, I think this bridge was uh, really close to the parking area. Find out in a minute, hopefully. All right, bridge I couldn't see this morning in the dark. Back at parking. Here's a uh, I'll run down of the trail. Pretty cool. Definitely do it again. <laughs> 